Charlie Cushane here. Today we're doing another interesting project on my truck and camper, and this time I'm going to actually be undercoating it with this PB Blasters Surface Shield. It's supposedly the best undercoating material you can put on the frame of your truck to keep it from rusting. And to put this on, it's a one gallon jug, I bought a sprayer with a couple of different hoses and nozzles to get in the frame and it comes with these one quart containers um, got a funnel so I can put it in here and I got a sheet of plastic to put down on my driveway so let's get out there and start undercoating first time doing surface shield never did it before so open the container and I guess we'll give it a good stir it's sort of like water it's pretty thin which is good good for spraying and man it doesn't need much stirring it's a uh, it's pretty good the way it is I thought I'd have to do a lot of stirring but it looks good. So I'm going to fill two of these quart bottles right here. I, hopefully that'll be enough, but you never know. I'm also going to be wearing latex gloves. I have some old KN95 masks, and you know why I have those. <laughs> and I'm going to wear my safety glasses, just so I don't get any in my eyes, hopefully. And I'm going to wear a coverall. So, Let's at least get this poured in. All right. Now this is a siphon gun, so it doesn't actually pressurize the container which is plastic, it actually just sends air across and it sucks it up and out. So let's go try it on the truck. This is how I sprayed the whole underbody. In the hole. I sprayed the whole underside of the truck and inside the frame rails um, sort of off camera because when I was on the creeper on my back under the truck it was almost impossible to spray with using two hands and hold the camera so after I got it all done I got out and had my wife now hold the camera and film so you could at least see some of the application process where I tried to spray as straight and uniform as possible and I did attempt to put on a relatively thick coat um, this has never been sprayed before and it went on beautifully and of course I didn't have to spray anywhere that you would normally spray on most trucks because it's a, it has an aluminum bed and body so I didn't have to spray inside the doors or um, the bottom of the bed so that helps speed things up as well
Although I can't talk to the long-term durability of Surface Shield, I feel I can accurately talk about the application process. Um, using the Surface Shield right out of the bucket um, at room temperature in the Wool Wax spray gun at 80 PSI, it allowed me to spray beautifully. It gave a nice even undercoating as long as you keep moving and I witnessed no drips. Even if I sprayed it a little heavy, it sort of spread out and didn't drip on the ground, which was amazing. Other undercoatings I've tried in the past definitely did drip. So I, I've checked for a day now underneath of the vehicle and there's no drips. So spraying this on worked fantastic. Of course, it's a new truck, so I wasn't really covering any rust, um, but this should at least keep it protected for two years, as they say, and then I can readdress if I need to spray again. If you've enjoyed this video, please remember to like and subscribe for future videos.